Seems like Chloe's dad always has a project around the house. I can't believe I won't be able to call Arcadia Bay home much longer. I slipped and broke this post a few years ago, but Chloe insisted on taking all the blame. Even after she got grounded, she never squealed. What a friend. I don't think I've ever actually seen anyone reading these books. I wonder if I'll ever take this view in again. I always like to imagine I could open that wardrobe and step into another world. I don't think I could ever handle a real life murder investigation. The two whales makes the best Belgian waffles. No other diner could even come close. So sweet that Chloe's mom takes this photo with her to work. Oh, Chloe's parents are so cute. Chloe's mom is trying to quit smoking. Hmm. Is that an email from the principal at Blackwell? The principal at Blackwell wants to meet with Chloe's parents. I wonder what about. gets in trouble. I'm glad her dad stood up for her. A voicemail? I wonder if it's still there. Sometimes I really wish I had siblings. Chloe hasn't mentioned a trip. Maybe it's supposed to be a surprise. Oh, so cool. Chloe is such a nature nerd. I bet she's gonna love it. Most strikes? <laughs> How can that be so cool and so dorky at the same time? It's awesome that Chloe's mom wants to teach kids. She'd be really good at it. I don't think I could ever handle a real life murder investigation. Makeup is great for acting in Halloween costumes. Any other time, I just don't get it. Chloe's mom bought me a toothbrush because I spend the night here so often. 
Well, I used to. The things inside this cabinet haven't changed very much over the years. I guess Chloe never really grew out of wanting to be a pirate. Entrance to the dark cavern is in there. Bluebeard's chosen hiding place for the mysterious amulet. There it is, the dark cavern. Crap, I can't get into the attic if I can't even reach the door. I need to find something to stand on. I'm sure I can find something around here to boost me up. Maybe this will make me tall enough to reach. It's a start. I gotta find something I can stack on top of it. I've gotta find that amulet before I meet Chloe out back. Chloe's room has always been home base. It's hard to think this might be the last scheme we ever plan here. won't be big enough for me to reach, but maybe I can stack things on top of it. Almost there. I just need a few more inches. Not bad for an improvised stepladder, but it's still not tall enough. If I stack a bunch of books on the stool, I could probably reach the attic. I think that should be tall enough. Should be stable enough. <laughs> Besides, what's adventure without a little risk? There is a ton of stuff up here. How will I ever? There it is. Of course Chloe hid the amulet in the hardest place to get to. I need to find a way through. Three till? I think I've heard of them.
The amulet looks kind of cool from the side. I remember it took this thing like a hundred years to rewind the land before time. Her parents couldn't part with this. I guess I see where Chloe gets her sentimentality from. I can't get through with this chair here. I think I can squeeze through now. Not a single country record. These must belong to Chloe's mom. I remember this. Chloe refused to get another goldfish after she had to flush Calico Jack. That's full of decorations Chloe made when she was five. She thinks they're embarrassing, but I think they're cute. It's a good thing I'm big and burly. Otherwise, moving this furniture would be kind of difficult. I need to move that desk, but distressor is in the way. Closer. Ugh, this desk's per It's a good thing I'm big and burly. Otherwise, moving this furniture would be kind of difficult. Keep it moving, desk. <laughs> Crap. Yes, you have to go back. It's a good thing I'm big and burly. Otherwise, moving this furniture would be kind of difficult. Keep it moving, desk. <laughs> Crap. Wow. 
one step closer. decorated this. Um, more like it destroyed it. Chloe and I had the best Halloween costumes. I bet there's some good stuff still in there. That's so cool. I wonder how many different moments this thing has captured. Hard to imagine Chloe's dad in college. I wonder what he was like. Maybe there's still some things in there. I guess Chloe's dad went through a hippie phase. Long Max Silver's eye patch. This will be perfect. how much I liked vintage things. This cooler is awesome. Glad this thing is empty. A fitting reward for a journey full of treasures. Got you. This thing is cool, I guess. I wish I could remember how it works.
Are you just watching me up there, Creeper? You are one of a kind, Chloe Price. What? I'm lucky you're my best friend, that's all. Damn right you are, you mushy weirdo. Did you find the amulet? Awesome. Now get your ass down here, we have treasure to find. <laughs> On my way. Dark Cavern was no match for you, eh? Long Max Silver to the rescue. Treasure's sure to be ours, Captain. Bring the amulet over here so I can see. Chloe is so excited. I better bring her the amulet before she makes me walk the plank. It's not that I don't like the blue. I'm just sad to see the old color go. One time, we stuck a bunch of this tape to Chloe's face to make a blue beard. Putting it on was a lot more fun than taking it off. This was a fun experiment. I'm almost surprised we actually managed to grow something. Poor Bongo. Chloe took his death so hard. I guess Chloe's mom comes all the way back here to smoke. Chloe and I have done lots of homework at this table. It's so weird we're at different schools now. I still wish I could live in the world we drew. I've spent so much of my life here. Every little corner is familiar. Comforting. These games we're playing. Buried pirate treasure from our past selves. Is this why I keep pushing off telling Chloe I'm leaving? Because I don't want to ruin this time together. How am I going What's up, to... dude? Bro. Don't you mean sis? Maybe I meant nerd. Dork. Punk. Punks are cool. You know what, Max Caulfield? What, Chloe Price? You're the freaking best. That's all. Damn right. About time you realized it. Just tell anyone and I'll deny it. Okay, enough of this shit. There's treasure to be unburying. Uh, 
I wish this was big enough to jump in. It's only September. It'll be totally dive bombable in a few weeks. Yeah. A few weeks. I'm really gonna miss Price Family Barbecues. <laughs> Are you ever gonna get your kite down from the roof? It was unhappy in captivity. I set it free. You must be a hero to kites everywhere. Chloe's bottle rocket. <laughs> The fastest way to get an entire bottle of soda in your hair. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's rum for me. Do you drink this? Yar. No, not really. I had to fish an empty bottle from the recycling bin. That's probably for the best. Some pirate you are. I wish I could freeze this moment. I never have to leave it. Hey, Chloe. Yar. Walk the plank. Perfect. This thing looks so much smaller than I remember. I can't believe Chloe still has it. Actually, after this morning, I can. I never understood why it's called a Jolly Roger. How jolly can you be if you're dead? Glider swings. The best way to simulate a storm on the high seas. Ah, my greatest work of art. I call it how I lost my magnifying glass privileges. Great art is never appreciated. Wait just a minute. Yar! You must ask permission before setting foot, er, peg, on another captain's boat. Permission to come aboard, Captain Bluebeard? Grrrr! One amulet. Coming right up. Okay, uh... I, th I think it goes... <sighs> Damn it. I forget how to make this... Stay on. Stay here. I think I saw some tape. <sighs> Thanks, Max. Just some tape left between us and the treasure. If you told me this morning that we'd be spending the day as pirates, I would have thought you were crazy. Yeah, I probably look like a loser, huh? Chloe, you could never be a loser. Even if you tried. Oh well, yeah, the best friend code requires you say that. It's just... This whole day has made me feel like a little kid again. I can't believe we were eight and nine when we planned this. I can. 
This tiny kid's head is squeezing the shit out of my head. <laughs> well, treasures don't find themselves. Lead the way. The mighty Captain Bluebeard in all her glory. I'll hold a ship down while you find some tape. Score. One step closer to getting that treasure. Whatever it is. Avast, matey. Have you brought me prize? Ahoy, Bluebeard. I have brought the stickiest tape in all the seven seas. Well done, fellow scallywag. Just like old times. Huh, Max? Remember how we used to talk about ruling the bays of Arcadia one day? We thought we were gonna be pirates forever. If being a pirate means acting silly and going on crazy adventures together, then we'll always be pirates. Hell yeah. Would you like to do the honors, Long Max Silver? Me? Are you sure? Of course. Come on, navigator. Point me to some treasure. Wait, how am I supposed to use this? The drawing on the lens. It should line up with something. Here goes nothing. Okay, this drawing is supposed to line up with something. Got it. <laughs> yes! You rock! Where is it? Here? Okay, take a step right. No, no, the other right. My other right or your other right? <sighs> My other right. Got it. Wait, what? Just go that way. Perfect. Now come towards me. Bingo. That is not what we buried. What is this? I, I don't know. Let's open it. From Bloody Bill. Who's that? I'll get the tape layer. Aha. <laughs> Chloe's dad is such a goofball. <laughs> it's me, Bloody Bill, the Pirate King. <laughs> what the heck? 
By now, you'll have seen that I dug up your treasure, which would normally make us mortal enemies. But hear me out. I haven't pilfered a thing. On the contrary, I figured you swashbucklers might not be back to your loot for some time, so I've given it extra protection from the winds and rain. I'm sure you're excited to open your time capsule, so I won't go on too long. Just know that Bloody Bill is bloody proud of you. Both of you. <laughs> Keep those sails trimmed and that anchor scrubbed. And always remember, the real treasure is... Friendship. Love. Your Oregon State prepaid college savings plan. <laughs> Ugh. That's what we originally buried. Huh, yeah. I guess it probably would have gotten ruined underground. Holy crap! It's Billy the Squid! He's alive! Oh, man! It really is like a time capsule. No way! Chloe, look at this. We wrote each other letters. <laughs> oh, I remember these. To Chloe Price. Thanks, Max. <laughs> I hope you are having a lot of fun being a teenager with your best friend. Aw, you are so cute. <laughs> Check it out. Ugh, Maxine. about mine. What did I write? This is so Chloe. You were really sweet. Oh, man. I was really goopy. I like it. That's because you're a goop. This is so cool. There's so much to look at. Is your mom going to mind about this mess? Dunno. I thought they'd be home by now. Max, remember scratch art? Oh, I love this stuff. I'm gonna draw something. these memories. I want to look at everything. <laughs> <laughs> 